Melbourne's West has a new hospital to help cope with the region's booming population. Named after former Premier Joan Kerner, the facility offers maternity and paediatric services that are said to be world class. Candice Ablocki has three children and is about to expand her young family. She will be one of the first women to use the birth suites at the new Joan Kerner Women's and Children's Hospital. The baths are bigger, they've got seats in them and they've got the handheld showers which help in pressure points. The hospital features 20 maternity delivery rooms, 237 beds, theatres and a rooftop garden. The centrepiece is the first neonatal intensive care unit in the western suburbs. So our quality of care will increase and our access to specialists will be even better. The facility is named after Victoria's first and only female Premier Joan Kerner. Today, her husband Ron opened the hospital in her honour. <laughs> Melbourne's West is the fastest growing region in the state. The facility will free up extra beds and reduce patient wait times at Sunshine Hospital. We'll get an additional 72 beds approximately. We've got funding for the new ED. A baby boom is underway in the western suburbs with more than 40 born every day. It's hoped this new facility will reduce the strain on nearby hospitals. We expect that 7,000 babies will be born here every year um, in, the, in the next few years. The first patients arrive in 10 days. Hannah Jenkins, 7 News.